Okay, this is called React OS. I've got it installed inside of a VMware session here on my Mac Pro uh, because I don't want to like hose a machine for this operating system. It's still in alpha development stages, which basically means it's in development. It's not really designed for everyday use, but uh, basically what this is is a alternative to Microsoft Windows which is designed to look and act like Microsoft Windows. You can see that it's got the start menu here, it's got everything in the same spot, programs, my documents, uh, settings along with the control panel, administration, network connections. Not quite as many icons in here uh, as you would see in Microsoft Windows but uh, I mean, th you can see that they've definitely made an effort here to make this thing look correct. Uh, it is properly detecting my system here. Uh, 128 megs of RAM, that's because the uh, this virtual machine is only giving it that much memory. This isn't actually uh, running, again, natively on my Mac Pro. Uh, let's see, check out display. You can see this, this looks exactly like Windows. You can select your screen res. Um, so again, I don't have to like do anything to figure out how to use this because it, it it's basically looks just like Windows XP. Now I'm going to go in and restart it here inside my virtual session so you can see just how incredibly fast this thing is. Let's go ahead and restart. Boom, boom, boom. There, done. Have you ever, ever seen Windows start that fast? Uh, I haven't since maybe back in the early days of Windows. I'm talking maybe 95, but I have never seen a version of Windows boot that fast. Um, so basically, that's what this is. It's not designed to uh, be a, a uh, uh, something that takes over for Linux. It's basically designed to be an alternative to Windows. Um, and with the high suck factor that's been uh, highly advertised these days with uh, Microsoft Windows Vista, and the fact that XP support is going to be coming to an official end sometime in the near future, unless they extend it, um, there's going to definitely be more uh, attention placed on on things like React OS because people want something that's not going to go anywhere, that's going to maybe not even be Microsoft, but still works like what people are used to. And just based on my clicking around here, it looks like this is pretty similar to what people are used to. Um, it's using what's called Wine, which is a way, it's basically a, a programming interface for uh, Windows applications on Linux, but from my understanding, uh, React OS is not actually Linux. It's not Linux with a with a Windows skin on it. It's actually its own thing. Uh, so I'm going to post some details along with this video as a blog post on PC Mac, so you can read about it yourself and feel free to give it a try. It is completely free. And again, I've got it running here in a VMware session, so it's just you know it's very easy to try, and I can just delete it whenever I feel like it. So I think it's pretty cool. So that's that.